Hey, it's Jason Creel. You know, I'm not the most mechanical person in the world, but I have uh, picked up a few skills and able to do basic work on my lawnmower. So today I want to show you how to change the blades on a lawnmower. Uh, now this zero turn mower, like most, has three blades. And the goal is to change these blades in three minutes. And so and let's talk a little bit about changing blades. Now, if you have a lawn service and you're mowing full time, um, I would recommend changing blades at least once a week, you know, so whether you're putting on new blades or sharpening uh, the old ones and putting them back on, you know, uh, once a week is, is, you know, it could be done more than that, but uh, if you can do it at least that, that, that will help. I know some people, I've, I've heard of people that change them multiple times a day and carry a portable air compressor and change them in the field. You know, I, I don't, to me, that's a little overzealous. So, um, so today I'm going to be, uh, let me show what you're using. So I've got some brand new blades, so I'm not going to uh, sharpen the ones. I like to buy several sets of blades for the mower, and that way when it gets time to change them, I can just put a, a new set on, or if I've already um, sharpened a set, I can go back and put those on. So when I take these off, the dull ones, I'm not going to necessarily sharpen those right away and, put the, uh, and then put them on. I'm going to put some new ones on, and I can sharpen those later. Typically, I, I like to sharpen the blades maybe, I don't know, three or four times um, before uh, throwing them away. So, um, but anyway, I'm, I'm putting the new ones on today. So, uh, to change blades, you know, I've got a, uh, this came from Harbor Freight Tools. A lot of this did. So, um, you know, it's not, uh, even at Harbor Freight, there's a, a cheaper line and a, a more expensive line. So, I've um, got a uh, impact gun here and it's a it's not the cheapest one though it's not that expensive but this one's a half inch uh, air impact wrench and has 90 psi max so um anyway you want you don't want to get just the smallest one they have because you want to know and there's it's one of the most frustrating things when you, you get your mower jacked up and you go take the the nut off and, and you can't get out or the bolt and in your impact gun doesn't have enough power and so at that point you know i have to get a breaker bar out and put a pipe on it get more leverage and so you know get an impact uh wrench that has enough power so uh, i've got the jack stands got the jack the thing about a jack is you want one that'll pick the mower up high enough off the ground um, this is not the only way to get a, a jack a mower up off the ground you could buy a mower jack which mounts to the front wheels and flips it up um, you can uh, get a chain hoist, you know, there's, there's other ways, there's other ways that are not that safe that I'm not even going to recommend, but um, anyway, so for this, this I think picks up the mower, it's about 23 inches is how high this is, a four ton jack, um, so you, you want to get it high enough off the ground, I wouldn't get one that was like 17 inches, um, because sometimes it's hard to get your impact wrench underneath the mower so you know get one that'll pick the mower up a little bit higher off the ground so all right let's just see if we can do this in three minutes or less changing the blades on this hustler mower
Well, you can see we did uh, make it in under three minutes, so that was a good thing. Um, the point is not that that I'm the fastest at changing lawnmower blades or someone couldn't do it faster or that there's not other ways to do it, but it's just to show you that if you're a homeowner or maybe you're new in the lawn care business that you don't have to be intimidated by simple tasks like changing your blades. You know, if you have the proper equipment, which is not that much to have, um, then it's something that you can easily do on your own. And so, anyway, I hope this video is helpful and shows you how I change my lawnmower blades and shows you it's something that you can do yourself. Thanks.